Well, hello everyone. It's another day for Strong Wars Adventure here. So it's time for some space engineers. So what have I been doing? Well, I built a new ship here. And what I've done is I've you added the merge block in there and the connector. And let me change the options here. <clears throat> the music still seems a bit loud. Perfect. Okay, so yeah, so I made a ship that allows me to you grind. Um, I'll show you the inventory here. I've been kind of busy grinding. Um, I've had another ship here. This is a, a, a sail, a private sail that I'm I'm dismantling. Um, I did dismantle another ship. It was a was it a business ship, um, a business shipment. So I dealt with that. And here, here's a a military mine layer that I took over as well, which I was lucky, um, which I have to dismantle, of course. And here I've started working on the thrusters here. I moved the thrusters from here to here, uh, just due to the fact that the doorway here adds extra space. And so I've done that. And now watch now. This is part of the new updates. They've added a couple things here. If we go UK, we can go into the Leviathan, and because of the antenna, we can actually just do this. Boom. See, and the doors are opening. I fixed the problem with the doors. Uh, the reason the doors were were destroying the, um, the track here is because of this corner tile right here. This needs to be a corner tile. If it's a flat tile like this, it'll destroy the the wall as it goes which is kind of interesting. I've also slower, slowered, <laughs> lowered the speeds of these, so that way it doesn't uh, you go so fast, so, so it doesn't jostle or nothing like that. Uh, let's see, I think everything is still okay. Yeah, okay, perfect, so let's go inside here. This is where the ship would be. <clears throat> I did do the, all this here, welded it and everything, and almost all done. Still gotta weld this stuff here. That'll take some time, of course. I have to weld the stuff in here. Uh, this is my old mining ship here. Oh, this is also what's cool. So those doors are open pretty much. Watch this here. There's these control panels you can add now into the game. And if we go T, I think is what it is. Look at that. I reversed it. Bang. Now it's, it's closing. <laughs> so that's amazing. So they've added the remote control. They've added... Uh, the buttons to it uh, this all still is the same we have the the medical room here um, of course you guys know about the gestures here I don't think we need to show that but let's do it anyways uh, oh I did, I did I did a duplicate let's do this let's see what these gestures are here uh, V V V Okay, all right, here we go. Let's try these gestures. Let's go zero. Okay, and let's go three. <laughs> How about number four? Whoa. Number five? Yeah. And then number six. Ah. <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, well, I'm not sure what those would be used for. Maybe if you play in a public game with other people. Um. So the plan here now, I think, is to extend this out towards that way. I think I'm going to build a reactor in the middle of this here. Maybe put two reactors, I don't know. Um, what I find is the ship is going to be huge. And I'm too late. I'm committed already into it. And so all I can do is continue. And I will continue as long as there's updates, as long as there's new features that we can add. And... With that in mind, I have to get back and do some more dismantling. Um, I do have to build another module. Um, now what I mean by that is I have to build another m module for this ship here that I have, this, this grinder ship. I need to build a welding module so that, whoa, crap. Yeah, they really changed the physics a bit too in the game. Uh, private sale, I don't need that. 
If I need fuel, I'd steal it, but... Okay, so let's do this here. Show you what I've been doing. I've been picking the grinders, turning them on, because the merge blocks, um, because the ship is merged, it allows you to, to manipulate um, the, the merge blocks, which is kind of cool. And so now, all I do is this. Let's see here. I want to take this first. Perfect. So now we'll take this. Oh yeah, this is working beautifully, guys. So this grinding ship is just phenomenal. Um, as soon as I have that welding ship, everything will speed up for this. Uh, this grinding ship has allowed me to, to dismantle you know, basically two ships in no time. Literally no time. So I definitely recommend it for all of you. And I tell you what, I will grind uh, this bit here. I'm just trying to think here. I want to do something. I want to build that module. Uh, let's see here. Is that is that drifting? No. Okay. Good. So my plan is to to dismantle this, and then dismantle that mine layer. And once that's done, I want to build more thrusters for this. And as well, what I want to do with this ship here, uh, let's move this ship a bit more. Uh, let's go right, away. go right into here. Okay, press uh, Y to turn on. Let's turn off the dampeners. Just go very, uh, very lightly, just up. Um, okay, the dampers on. Let's go back a bit more. So the plan I have here. Maybe just like this. Yeah, so the plan I have here is basically to create kind of like a, a ship port. Now, what does that mean, a ship port? Well, I was figuring of putting a doorway in here somewhere and then having access to, to kind of like hangar doors here. One here, one here, and then maybe a whole bank of them in the front and then the same on the sides here. Um, the reason I got that idea was because of all this stuff here. So uh, I was thinking I would just basically, uh, I need materials, let's see here. Let's see if there's any materials in this ship still. Um, oh yeah, I do have some materials, good. Let's grab some plates. So basically I'll, sh I'll show you here quickly what I was gonna do. So I was gonna, uh, what's this? Basically, I was gonna fill in this part here. Um, yeah, I think that's exactly what I was gonna do. I was gonna fill in this part here. And essentially, I was gonna go two out. Um, so let's keep going here. Just I can always tear it down just to show you guys. So, let's see here. So basically, I would have right here would be a doorway that's going to go up and down and open and close. And what that's going to allow me to do is, let's see, I'd probably put the piston right about here to push the door open and closed. Yeah, that's probably about right where I need. To, uh, one, so one, two, three, four. Four. That doesn't make sense to do four, eh? Hey? Makes sense to do five. So let's see here. So that's middle. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. We'll do doorways of five. And um, if I can do the piston here, I think that's what I want. Let's check this out. Yeah. Okay, I apologize for that. Just had some technical difficulties. So what I did is I built a little bit more. I built this out like I said I would. Um, because the pistons have their weird mechanism on the end, 
I'm just going to kind of figure out where it's going to go. So I need to go down about how big I want the door to go up, which means I want it to go about five squares up. So let's see this. If I can go one, two, three, four, five. Okay. So right there. Right where I'm pointing is where one, two. So this is where the piston is going to go. And what this mechanism is going to operate is going to operate the doors that are going to open and close. And because I brought this down enough, I think it should be okay. Let's, let's check this out here. Let's build this. Um, I need lots of materials. Large steel tubes, motors, computers. Large steel tubes, motors, computers, I need everything. It sucks. So, let's go large steel tubes. Um, no motors, no computers. How about these guys? I can't remember any construction components. Uh, how about small steel tubes? I don't know. Uh, computers and motors. I think they're in here. That private seal is coming awfully, awfully close. Way too close for comfort. Holy crap. Shouldn't even be coming this close. Man, look at that. You can see it. Almost interceptible. What do you guys think? That's hilarious. It's going to pass right by, I think, I hope. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, it should be okay. It's going to be far away. But man, that's close. I've never seen them traverse that close to the ship before. That's pretty scary. Whoa! When I died. Yeah! <laughs> Man, that's crazy. What happened there? Inertial dampeners. Stupid me. Fuck. Where's my body? Well, that sucks. Hey, guys. I just lost some materials. Bullshit. Oh well. <laughs> so yeah, so anyways, let's carry on here. Um yeah, so I lost all that material. That's bullshit. Fuck. Let's try this again. Okay, needs large steel tubes. Need some of these. Need some of these. Good thing there's lots of material, so it's not like it's a big deal. You can always mine, you can always uh, you create it. Um, there's always, always something you can do to get more material, so it's not like it's crucial anymore. Uh, let's grab some of these. Uh, some of these. Now let's try not to die. <laughs> Uh, okay, dampers are on. No, I'm not sure why it was like that, but whatever. Okay, uh, so let's, let's weld this here. I don't normally do this on camera, but this time it, I'll decide to show it. Just to, to show you how this all works. So we'll do this. And then there's, there's this top piston part here. And this part is always extends out fur further than normal on all sides so you be aware of that when you try and create some cool things that are flush and let's see here I think I need to one two three four five okay so now we need to build this so we need pieces we need these blast door pieces here we need that one that one in the corners and I'm not sure about the invert, the inverted corner. So, with that in mind, three it is. Okay, see how it's turned like that? We need to change the orientation. There we go. Uh, one, two, three, four, and one more right here. Four, five. Oh, uh, okay, five. And then one, two, 
three, and then this is gonna be the corners. Three, um, page down, four, and then let's see, right here, yeah. And let's do this page up. Yeah, there we go. And we're just gonna continue building this until eventually it's done. Uh, yeah, okay. And then let's do this side. Okay, uh, one more. And now we can build down these sides here. And so all this does is, this allows it to slide up and down. Um, shit. Look at this right here. Uh, good thing it doesn't need this. Fuck. I wonder if I keep building it. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know. I wonder what's going to happen. We're going to have to experiment with this. I should be able to do this. I should be able to stick it here. Uh, page up. Page up. Okay, do that. Maybe the inverted corner right here. What do you think? So if I take this out uh, and then I put this inverted corner. Uh, let's see, page up. Okay, uh, page down. Yeah, I think that looks a little bit better, just internally, anyways. <laughs> Okay, and I'll do this side here. Page up, I think. No, oh yeah, there we go, yep, page up. Boom, boom, boom. And then we do this one again. Page up. Okay, and then we take care of this. Okay, and um, this be number six. Inverted, page up to change there we go okay so now with that done I don't trust this this side piece here so I'm just gonna take this out just because I don't know if this will move as expected so basically with this being the door what we'll be able to do I might have to make it one more so I might have to lower it one more which sucks but anyways let's try this let's give this a shot so I like to make things flush. And so that means, let's do this. Let's try a little bit different color brick. Uh, just for you know, the sake of it being different. Um, so basically we can put blocks here. Now you notice there's a little gap here. Now, I'm gonna probably have something on the front here so that when they're, they're, they're closed, it looks cool. Um, but here, let's take a look at this. So, if we take a look at our piston, it extends out. Oh, where are we? Piston number three. That's what we're. We have piston three. So let's rename this to piston. Um, um, shoot, piston hull door one. There you go. Piston hall door one. And um, velocity. Maybe two meters per second. Uh, maximal distance is 10, minimal distance is zero. So I'm not sure. So we'll just give this one a shot. So let's actually do, do it remotely. So watch this. So we'll go K. And I go into the Leviathan. Because we renamed our piston, well, we should be able to find it easily. Piston hall door one, click reverse, and voila, look at that, the door is closing. And what this is gonna do, I might speed it up, I don't know. Um, I'm not sure how high this, oh shit. Yeah, um, see how this is all nicely blocked up? Well, I need to take that out because this mill piece is would destroy that and this door will determine yeah it might need only three blocks hey okay? maybe only three blocks high yeah sick of that now to fix this okay yeah plenty that's plenty room so it's too much uh, 
here. Uh, hopefully it doesn't destroy anything. Still going. Still going. Still going. Boom, done. Okay, so that's how big the doors I was going to do. I don't know, maybe, maybe that will be okay. One, two, three, four blocks big. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. maybe. So I'll do one more door over here. And then that way there'll be two doors here. And then over here. Ooh. Mm -hmm. So maybe I'll just do doors on the sides and then this will be like an inside area. I think that's what we'll do. We won't have any doors on the front here. Just because it's going to cut into the existing doors down here. So yeah, so I don't know. I'm going to carry on work here. Uh, I'll show you as updates progress. Uh, let's close this door for the final thing. Um, oh, not blast doors. Uh, piston, hall door. One, reverse, boom. Okay, yeah, I'll have to play with this stuff. And hopefully when I come back, um, there'll be a lot more done. Uh, these ships should be all eliminated and, and torn apart by then. The materials transferred to the, the ship here. Um, yeah. Well, thank you everybody for watching. Uh, this Space Engineers is an amazing game. If you guys don't have it already, I suggest you you go out there and get it. <laughs> and yeah, I'm very curious if I had a block here, if it would do anything, because that's the same idea as down here with these blocks. You know, these blocks I think are technically in this block here. But because of the blast door corner, the sides, it slides right through. So, yeah. Well, thank you everybody for watching. I hope you had a great time You're coming along for the ride. Um, this episode is a little bit longer than usual. Um, we're also working on, on some special survival um, videos that me and Lushable Echo are working on. I'm quite excited to, to kind of work on that footage. Um, we're going to release that footage at a certain time frame just because of, of the nature of it is, so we can't cheat off of each other. Uh, but that's about all I'm going to say about it. So thank you everybody for, for watching, and you all have a great day. <laughs>